and I got the keys right here. Let's cold start her up. Sorry about the traffic noise. We got semis. There's some kind of industrial stuff going on. And I do not take this for granted. I'm glad I have this. Silverado does not have remote start. I could get it, but I'm not gonna just add it. Put money into something else, performance-wise. Oh yeah, she never fails. She never fails. Cummins will always start up. It's amazing, amazing truck. Yep. That's why you buy a truck. So like the other video, I'm not sure how this video is going to pan out. I've always just planned them out. But this time, I'm starting to just grab the camera, panning out the day with you guys and seeing what happens. Sometimes it's something I never thought would actually happen. It's what I always hate about the remote start. The one thing I'm noticing different now is that the Ram doors just seem to be a bit lighter than the Silverado doors. Maybe just me. So how can I forget to prepare for takeoff by setting the jet option or the smoke button? There we go, sounds so good. And I look at this, I look at this bolt differently than everybody, because if you guys remember when I installed the tow mirrors, they gave me bolts that were way too long and actually scratched up against the door here. That was horrible. The first mod to the Cummins, tow mirrors. You would hear it just scratch and grind. Sold the old ones and got good feedback for them. So, so it always used to bother me to be able to vlog in front of other people because there's there's a lot of other people around here. And whenever people see me or look at me, whenever I'm doing this, I'd always just shove the camera in my pocket and I'd be like, oh, this is too sketchy. I don't want to embarrass myself or anything. But now it doesn't bother me at all. It really doesn't bother me. Sometimes you can't tell if it's a Cummins or not. But then you look at that big ass exhaust tip and then you know exactly what it is. Bob Nine. the two-tone the new chevys we're wondering guys i did switch all the tennessee presets to pennsylvania sketchy business <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> that truck was awesome. I'm pretty sure I knew who that is. Those are definitely some big tires to be running. I guess if you gear it right, you'll be good. So just got the Gorbs once again. We're about to roll. What are your thoughts about that truck? Check out that truck. This is something I want to do with my back bumper is black out the bumpers. Don't you think that looks better than chrome bumpers? It's way harder to scratch it too. I think it looks so much, but this is what I did on my Silverado and well, they even have the back rear parking sensors I didn't even know they did that on work trucks. It's a lot more practical. The coolest feature about your 2019 moonroof up here Holy crap This is not edited He has to open that up so it doesn't overheat, right? Yeah. This old woman behind me was like <laughs> She got mad, dude. <laughs> if I play it too loud, it'll rattle my lug nuts loose. Stopping to get some food real quick, and I'm probably gonna get three of these. He's gonna get about five of those. Maybe six. I'm gonna gamble real quick. You guys all know who that is, but we're gonna head back on the road because we got a crazy adventure to go on today. Did not think this would pan out today. Did not think I'd get the box out, but we are ready to go. Are you ready, dude? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at that. It's an old Maybach. Would you buy it? Yeah. For Holy sale. God, for for sale. sale. Oh, dude, buy it, dude, buy it, dude. to my attention tesla roadster 2.0 can do 0 to 60 in 1.9 seconds 
It doesn't have a transmission, so it has all its power right at the beginning. And even the semi truck haul a lot faster and more efficient than the semi trucks, the diesel semi trucks that they have now. And my opinion here is, is that I know that this is the future, electric cars are the future and they're taking over petroleum and diesel and it's all gonna go away. There's just something about diesel and a screaming V8 engine that I love so much. That, see, screaming V8.